So, still cooking, I had to pee. Glad I didn't. Ah, eh, whatever, I'm not gonna say that out loud. But I told you that I got punched in the face by accident today. Guy was pull starting a motor and when he pulled back, he fucking, I walked into his fucking fist. Almost knocked me the fuck out. But what he did do, fucking knock my fucking earring out of my fucking head. Now I can't get the fucking parts. Did you hear that music? It's fucking wicked good. It's a motorcycle. Fucking guy's got a nice sound system on that fucking bike. Actually, the sound quality of this video probably sucks. Fucking dick. I should not say that. So now I gotta put my fucking earring back in my fucking head. Probably dirtier than anything else. Okay. Oh, they're going to Taco Bell, all them guys on the bikes. Try and fucking good like that. Peppers are getting fucking melty. I'll show you that in a minute. So I'm at this hotel, and there's a couple of the guys that I work with that stay here too. They're probably watching either that or they're playing fucking Xbox. See, can you see that? See how melty them peppers are getting? They're all gonna be nice and happy. They're gonna be happy when I shove them in my fucking head. Oh, that's the wrong spot for that. And one more piece of cheese. And then that's it. Because this shit's wicked good. Yancey's fancy. This is a smoked gouda. Because they didn't have the smoked gouda with bacon, but I got three fucking wedges of that at the house. Where do you see that? Oh, next weekend might be weird with COVID cooking because I think I'm bringing my Harley out. Oh. Oh, they have grills out back here. Yeah. We'll figure it out. Knife on my pant leg. Don't judge me. Everybody wiped their knife on their pant leg and ate off it. Nobody'd have fucking COVID. Everybody'd be immune to everything. So, who the fuck are you to tell me? Everything's looking pretty fucking tasty. You guys are fucking missing out. You know what I do? I should. Any of Yeah, what I should say. Is any of the people that I know that actually see this, do I not give you enough information on the stuff that I'm using? Uh, give me some fucking input, some feedback. I'll tell you what, I'm pretty happy with this Cuisinite grill. They have them on the space fucking space balls, spaceships. But uh, I'm pretty happy with it. It does a nice job, dual burner, all stainless. It's got the long hose for the big tank, the 20 pound instead of the little fucking, what are they, two pound fucking propane tanks? They suck dick. Just saying. Just saying. Like two pound, you gotta have like 10 of them. This fucking grill would eat fucking two of them a fucking, eh, probably three a week. But they ain't chewing up that pro, my other grill. I ran a fucking whole summer on that fucking propane tank, a 20 pounder. Which was awesome. So, I'm gonna flip these fucking pork sticks. I'm gonna show you that. Because, holy Jesus. Look at all that pork juice at the bottom of my girl. This little fucking thing. Fucking cup runneth over. Oh, yeah. Oh, wait. You didn't see that. Not used to that. Oh, they didn't need to be flipped yet. No. 
this in. I might not be fucking emerald. But, nope, shit, what is that? Can't they? That's pretty nasty. I'm gonna have to clean that with something. I wonder if I can get any fucking napkins. Whatever. Oh, I got hand sanitizer. That's what I do. Hey, COVID cooking. What the fuck do you want from me? I think I got some. Whatever. Shut up. Alright, so this thing's fucking cooking and fucking cooking and cooking. I'm gonna turn the heat up a little bit. Just a little bit. I don't wanna fucking burn shit. The peppers are gonna be fucking pretty close to done now. Devil's asshole. Oh, they're fucking melty as fuck. Yes. Fucking genius. I am the fucking best. Well, maybe not, but these fucking things. Holy fuck, these are gonna be so good. They actually really probably need to be fucking ground a little bit more. I think they're gonna be alright. This one definitely is asking to get eaten. <laughs> yeah. Holy. Oh my god. Good. That is so fucking good. Fuck yeah, dude. If you don't do that, you're dumb. I'm just saying. It's not my fault that it's not my fault you're dumb. It's your parents' fault. Mmm. Drippy cheese squeeze. Mmm. Holy fuck, dude. Can you make them at a barbecue? The people are gonna be like, oh my god. I love this so much. Where did you get this idea? Don't tell them you got it from me. Actually, yeah, do. Tell them you got it from me. Because I'm fucking awesome. I forgot. I was going to put on some fucking music. But I'm using my goddamn phone. For this cooking show. Watch Pot Never Boils. Whatever. God damn, them peppers are good. What a fucking great idea. Fuck. I got Hormel's real bacon bits in my fucking... I should have put them into peppers. And then I'd have fucking smoked Gouda with bacon. Sometimes I swear to God, I think... I'm 46. I know I look like I'm in my 50s. Shut up. Anybody who puts that on or makes comments about that, you're not going to the island next door to Epstein's Island. Don't get mad at me. I'm just saying. Oh, yeah. Dude, them peppers are... Dude, what a great idea. I did that a couple of years ago. It was the first time I did it. buddy of mine I don't have his permission to use his name but he should get full on props for the idea I was working out here in Rochester and we were cooking on the grill and uh, he had these nice steaks and he smeared them with goat cheese which I'm going to do next week and I, oh wait yeah yeah I might they got grills here at the fucking hotel. I just wanted to do this on the back of my truck. So you can see what the fuck's going on. So we did these steaks. And he smeared the tops. 
just as he was getting ready to take him off the grill, he smeared the top with goat cheese. No, I had never had goat cheese. I'm gonna fucking tell you wow. Man, it was fucking astounding. It was the best. It was the best I ever had. I liked it. It was supposed to be sunnier today. But it's not cold. So I'll take that. Uh, so the whole idea behind the cooking, like I'm gonna cook these two big pork steaks and shit like that, and I got cooked all these peppers. I'm not gonna eat all that shit tonight. Because I normally would take that to work in the morning and eat it for breakfast and lunch. I cook a huge fucking dinner and then I have it for breakfast and lunch in the fucking morning. Uh, I was just looking at my finger. Uh, I was out on the boat and I fucking... And my finger got hurt. See ya? <laughs> yeah. Fucking ripped a chunk out of that. Now it hurts. It's one of them things that's gonna hurt for like three fucking weeks because it'll never fucking heal because I keep fucking with it. What the fuck was I just talking about? God damn it. Whatever. Oh, the fucking goat cheese? Was I still on the goat cheese? It was fucking astounding. The, the Wegmans. Which is another local thing. Obviously, I'm upstate New York, so Wegmans is a big thing. They have this goat cheese from... Italian seasonings or something on it. Smear that on a fucking steak. Oh. Hey, like I'm fucking Italian. I'm a fucking Polak. I'm Polish, Lithuanian. Yeah. Polish, Lithuanian, French, Canadian, and Mohawk Indian. I don't even know which part of me to hate. So. Actually, there's some other shit in there too. Because who knows this goddamn uh, 23 and Me thing. I don't even. I might not even be who I am. <laughs> so weird. Oh, this time I thought it was me. Apparently my uncle. Uh, I should just shut the fuck up. Uncle. <laughs> uncle Carbuncle. I'm gonna get a fucking beard. boring without me? You guys good now? How about my fucking product placement? See it? Oh, hey. I'm gonna have to figure out Mr. Miller's name so I can call him up and be like, yo, bitch. I shouldn't say that. Yeah, fuck him. He ain't gonna like me anyway. But I like your beer, so I'm gonna keep drinking it. They should sponsor me, though. So, what I wanted to do is I, I was going to get the fucking uh, the goat cheese, and I was going to put it on these pork steaks because I wanted to see how it would be, because it's awesome on steaks. But, because I have never tried these jerked pork steaks, the jerked pork from Buckingham's, I've never tried it before, so I wanted to fucking try them on their own, judge them on their merit, and see what I wanted to do with them. More motorcycles. I wish I was on my fucking motorcycle. That one's fucking sick. Extended swing arm. It's like, uh, it's pretty sick. So, so, you wouldn't know that there's a fucking pandemic. I'm social distancing. Because you see all my fucking friends, right? <laughs> I got all I got all three of them right in here. Yeah. Wicked fucking funny. <laughs> Whatever. All right. Just waiting for some fucking random asshole to come out of this fucking hotel and be like, what in the fuck is this guy doing? Other than being a fucking crazy fucking mess. Look at the fucking hair on this thing. Nobody can get a haircut. It's been fucking months. I don't normally get my hair cut anyway because I don't give a fuck. Uh, all right, pork steaks. The fucking peppers. I don't want to eat any more of the peppers because I won't eat the fucking pork. 
I'm not going to eat all the pork because I got to have it for breakfast and lunch tomorrow. But I want to have some of it. But I already ate, a hand, I ate three of these fucking peppers. Three? Yeah. They were fucking good. I might fucking eat a fucking other one. <laughs> Fuck tomorrow. Yeah. Why eat tomorrow what I can eat today? Nom nom. Yummy. Yeah, yummy. Way better than what you're eating. <laughs> yeah, it is. So, we got another minute or so on these pork steaks. This is going to be a dual video thing. I don't know how to edit these together. I gotta, I'm going to have to figure that out. But I don't know if you can tell by looking at me. I'm not the video editor of the fucking year. Yeah, these are fucking pretty close. I wish I had my little probe. I would fucking stick my fucking probe in that fucking... In that pork. <laughs> yeah, that's right. fuck are you to tell me where to stick my probe? <laughs> I stuck my probe in turkey. I stuck my probe in chicken. The only thing I don't stick my probe in is beef. Because <laughs> I'll eat dead shit mooing. What's that in that movie? They said fucking knock off the horns, wipe his ass, and put it on a fucking plate. It's about where I'm at. When it comes to beef. But not hamburger. Because if there's any fucking... Any shit on the exterior of that meat... When they mulch it... You can get some fucked up shit from that. So I cook my fucking hamburger... Hard. Like... Fucking well done. But my steaks... As long as I sear the shit on the outside... The fucking temperature on the outside... It's not like it's gonna fucking be all fucking... In the... Maybe... I don't know, but I ain't ever been sick, so I don't give a fuck, and I'm going to keep doing it my way, because I don't give a fuck what you think. Yeah. A lot of fucking people moving around. I guess we're coming to the end of it. They're opening shit up in waves. We're in upstate New York, so. I mean, the COVID thing, we're going to be dealing with that every year. It's an invasive species at this point. You're never going to get rid of it. You're always going to see it. It's going to be like, it's going to coincide with flu season. Yeah, whatever. Awkward silence. Keeps you on your toes. <laughs> yeah, shut up. I'm going to fucking check this out. Do you mind? Oh, whatever this is, I'm going to eat it. Oh, yeah. That's that does not look done yet, so I'm not going to eat it. Oh, yeah. Come on, flip over, you fucking fuck. All right, so this might be a three-part video, because I'm going to pee again. <laughs> <laughs>